Hello everybody and welcome to this video of Awesome Dads. You're actually so well! <laughs> We've been doing a quick match today. Uh, man, I just recorded a Binding of Isaac episode that I'm not super happy with at all. Actually, I'm really kind of annoyed with how that run went, but whatever. I made it to like, I don't know, the dank depths. So, uh, whatever. I'm sure that's fine. Uh, I also feel a little bit under the weather. It's just like a permanent blockage at the back end of my nose like you know where your throat and the back of your nose kind of meets it's there it's just like this constant like we've infected you like it's this feeling where all i like i'm surprised i don't sound like a, you know inspector jacques clouseau on like a regular freaking basis if you if you wonder where that frick that reference comes from uh try thinking Way back in the 19, I'm guessing 70s, there's a series of movies called the the Pink Panther. It's where the typical theme comes from, you know. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Like that, that theme, if you've never heard it by the way, it's an awesome theme. Like don't take my shitty singing uh, seriously there. But the main character, <laughs> Christ, it takes me forever to make a point. The main character in that story is a guy called Inspector Jacques Clouseau. And uh, I don't even remember the story. All I know is that he talks with a fresh accent as if his nose is plugged. So it's uh, simultaneously the worst and the best. At this, like, you know, it, it's, 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 it's a mixed bag, really. Anyway, today we're going to be playing Savinian Spike, who is the exact opposite of an Inspector Jack Clouseau. He is the thief. Yeah, she. And uh, hopefully we can do him justice. Yesterday I tried to record an episode with him, and it was a really good episode. But something dicked up with OBS, and I wasn't happy about it. We're actually going to be not going for Cloud right away. Uh, we are going to eventually get the Cloud. Why? Cloud is arguably one of the best defensive moves in the game. And it is super worth your time to make sure that you pick it up. When you do pick it up, it gives you the ability to actually really enjoy uh, your time. You know, take it easy, take it safe. And for a Vinny and Spike character these days, that's really important. Because uh, he's, uh, he's uh, had some nerfs. He's not the strongest anymore. Like, he's, uh, he's got a lot of price issues. We're not going upstairs through there anymore. Uh, we already pushed out the bottom, which is kind of nice. We're going to put on some pressure up down here. Why not? Look at that. That was hard. Just do some damage. Get sniped away so it's not a big problem or anything. He The Durple took a, a metric amount of damage, to be honest there. So that's good for us. We are really not doing well on this whole solar farming front. We are up against, uh, let's see. We got some characters on our team who are actually very good at farming. We're going to have a hard time getting solar this round. But that's okay. Uh, we are, like, if they get solar, it's just as good, really. Our main job here, though, is to push stuff out and go for, um... Yeah, kill that immediately. Our main job here is to push stuff out and get last hits whenever it is possible. Like that, except for without taking all that extra damage, hopefully. Uh, Alright, so they're de... Derpole lived? Or something? Uh, okay, that's a little bit strange. I'm, I'm a little weirded out as to what happened there. I hope that the Derpole is okay, though. Managed to save our frog, or at least uh, protect our frog from a little bit of extra damage, so that's okay. Now let him take that HP there. Take up the coins here, and we're at 130. Okay, we're not quite at 135 yet. Like, this is a slow game for us right now. We are not getting a lot of solar. Uh, the good news is our two teammates are doing a lot of good work. They are making sure that the lanes are pushed up and that they're having a good time. We're going to do the same thing, though. And eventually, we'll be able to start, like... Oh, we're we're going to probably get pushed up against our turrets. Because we're up against the Swamp Donkey here. And Swamp Donkey's getting himself murdered. That's unfortunate. Uh, I think it's because of lag. I mean, I definitely went today and did some damage, so I feel a little bit of guilt. But not too much, to be honest with you. Again, I might have mentioned it a little bit below the weather. And uh, at this point, my nose does not want to cooperate with how I want to speak or how I want to be. 
And I don't care. Oh, blind him. And he got killed. Nice! That that blind actually might have done something. I'm not exactly sure what it did. <laughs> to be honest with you. I'm gonna go in for that last hit. Managed to get the last hit on both of those. And on top of that, uh managed to deal her some damage. Like that's a that's a triple threat of amazing right there. That's exactly what you want. Alright, our next item pickup, now that we've got Smoke Cloud, we've got everything else, I'm going to pick up some HP here too. I'm thinking it might be a good idea to go for some other stuff. Oh, I'm, I'm decked, aren't I? Yeah, I'm very decked. Oh! Oh! No! How? I was buying the turret. Oh, well. Uh, oh, that's how. Spikes the 300 every once in a while. That's impressive. Well, that was unfortunate. I swore I had made it. But that's okay. We're still ahead in terms of experience. And uh, their Durple had to leave, so they're down to a bot. My two people. Honestly, it's been down to a bot and two people anyway. We're just farming on the Durple who's lagging out anyway, so no big deal. I'm going to pick up Solar Crab Burgers. Uh, we're picking it up because we are going to be moving around picking up a lot of Solar. And it does do a reasonable amount of HP regen increase, to be frank with you. It's not like it does anything outside of... Uh, Solar crab, like it doesn't do anything extra now. The cloud does not give you. There is no money upgrade for the cloud anymore. There's no increased solar capabilities for Vinny, which means that he has to spend most of his time in the early game playing very safe and only going for dashes that he knows can work out in his favor, or the very least inconvenience his enemies enough that uh, he's uh, he's okay. We're gonna take that before anyone else does, so that we can continue to push and uh, put up this pressure that we absolutely need to keep uh, to keep up if we want to. Uh, just have an easy game. And I don't mind having an easy game once in a while. Man, I got both of those last hits there too. That's very good for us. Why are last hits important in this game, of all games? Well, that's the thing. In this game, uh, unlike other ones where last hitting isn't really all that important. Like, I'm joking here. Uh, last hitting is ultimately important in every single MOBA that there is. Um, and it's more important in other MOBAs because in other MOBAs that's the only way that you actually get money in the first place. You're like, you get a little bit less money if you don't get the last hit yourself, or you get no money if somebody doesn't last hit, or something dumb like that. Um, and in this case you can actually still pick up the money if you don't get the last hit. Now the reason why the last hit's important with Vinny specifically is one, you have a really good tool for it. It's not difficult to, to use. Ow, wah. Uh, it's not difficult to use at the same time. Uh, it gives you a reasonable amount of guaranteed money. Whenever you get the last hit on something in this game, you do get the money directly deposited into your, you know, rather fashionable pockets, if you don't mind my saying so. Oh, come on, reallys. I broke that, uh, I broke that anchor pretty hard. I'm a little surprised that he didn't, uh, have to pay the ultimate price for that. That Leon's gonna be a pain in the butt, too. So we are looking to start picking up damage now that we've got access to a decent amount of HP and sustain. We got one of the last hits there. No, not even close. We are going to pick up both of those gold solar coins, but at what cost? No cost, thankfully. I was very scared when I saw the Swiggins. I was thinking to myself, I'm going to die today. Uh, no death. We're going to dash away from that particular... Oh, engagement! The frog dashed in, but he managed to get up because he's frog, so he don't give a shit. He don't give a shit. Uh, it's not enough! I thought that it dealt a reasonable amount of damage there, but no, not today. That's okay. Dealt a little bit of damage on our way up there, too, so that was a little acrobatic. I'm okay with that. That's all well and fine. What could possibly go wrong? Okay, so we know those are Swiggins. We know that if we jump in on our own, we're, we're boned. We're going to deal some damage to the Swiggins and just back off. No problem there. And then uh, get some farm here, too. Wow, we uh, managed to get both those co uh, both of those gold coins as well. Like, we are actually doing well for money right now, which is impressive, to say the least. We managed to pick up both of those as well. We're rolling in it! We're getting all kinds of random last hits. I'm happy with this. Oof. That'll stop the droid wave from pushing in, and we can just clear out the waves as a result. No problems. And now the Leon's having a hard time staying connected as well. It's as if that, uh, that particular slot... Is a in the Steam servers is a uh, cursed or something? Pick up a coin, pick up another coin, keep going, get the last hit, keep going. Now the one thing that we have to be careful about is shit like that happening, <laughs> where our teammate just dies horribly for it. 
Uh, that, that squid's got something. Let's see, does he have pool boy yet? I don't know. Uh, I wasn't able to check. Uh, Nickel. Nicholas. What are you doing? Yeah, solar crab burgers. You're doing wonders. I love you. Uh, there we go. We're gonna manage to pick up another couple of, uh, dollars. Holla hollas. Which is great. Happy with that. Nicholas is just going ham as far as this bottom push is concerned. But uh, I'm I'm wondering at what at to what end. At some point it's gonna get gonna get hairy. Wow, a lot of damage on all of those parties involved. We we did well in that fight. Ah! Wow, we actually have also a big enough dash to be able to poke through there. If we had been a little bit quicker, we might have actually been able to uh, get a kill there. Wouldn't that be nice if we could just, uh, wouldn't that be nice if we could get a kill? That's okay, though. You don't necessarily need to always get the kills. Point! Ah, uh, hopefully that saves our frog. Why did I just jump into what looked like imminent danger? Well, I saw that the Swiggins had used all of his shit. And, uh, that our frog had been hooked. I don't like my frog being hooked, uh, for one, so I stopped that from being a thing. Uh, what are we gonna pick up at this point? Um, yeah, let's do that. We only need ten more solar to be able to get our bag full of goldfish working. And it's going to give us a lot of move speed, at least I think. Or did I pick up the wrong upgrade? What upgrade did I pick up? Oh, no. I picked up Rocketeer. Okay, so that's just increased size. So we're going to be going for Silence Cloud next. It also means that our cloud is a lot bigger, which means that we have a larger blind area. Let's look at the upsides here. That that could be really good in these team fights, where seemingly uh, Swiggins can't play against blind. Like, it's a huge blind area. It's It's impressive. Like, we got in, we got out. The only thing we need now is, like, a little bit of silence and we'd be, uh, freaking, uh, stroking our noggins. Yeah, that blind is huge. <laughs> Holy shit. Never mind. Rocketeer. Upgrade of the hour right now. I'm, I'm impressed. It shouldn't be. Like, blind is, it has not historically been one of those upgrades that's been very good. I don't just do that, thanks. Yeah, but blind has not been historically one of those upgrades that actually ends up doing a lot of work. So, uh, yeah, you just waste your tongue. That's down for another seven seconds. I'm okay with this. I'm just gonna drop down another cloud here. A little unsure as to what's going on right now. Cornell Heal is having a hard time staying connected, which kind of sucks. Still a little bit worried as to what our spot in the game's like. That's okay. I am wondering. Would it be a good idea to pick up a... Oh, that was bad. <laughs> yeah, we need to be a little bit safer around that Swiggins. That Swiggins can do a lot more damage than what we give him credit for. If we're uh, being smart, we should uh, back off. We are going to poke where we can, though. Like, those little dick pokes that I'm managing to pull off. And I call them dick pokes only because it seems like it's a dick move to do. Um, those little pokes where we manage to pull off a little bit of extra damage for no good reason at all, like that. Uh, are actually really, really potent. And the reason for that is because it's free damage. We barely, like, there's almost no risk of us getting retaliated against. And, uh, yeah, it's it's great for uh, most people involved. Okay, no one's gonna follow me into there. No one wants to risk the cloud. Cornelio is actually doing a reasonable amount of push. I'm wondering how they have uh, so much more experience than we do. Is it just because they're, like, in more lanes at once? No, that's a that's a possibility here. Oh shit! Uh, he managed to get out. Good saw blade. Good saw blade. Ow! That hurt. Okay, between my nose, the back of my nose being a jerk there, and uh, everything else going on, I was uh, I, like I'm I'm actually having a really difficult time. Uh, like, speaking. <laughs> that's, that's... I don't, I don't know. I'm, I'm at a loss right now just because it's, like, a pain in the butt to do anything uh, useful right now. Uh, let's, uh, blow up this anchor before they have a chance. Oh, I took it back. That's lame. That's fine. I mean, it happens. It's, it's how you play. If you play a Swiggins right, you can just pick up your anchor whenever. It's no, uh, pick up your anchor whenever. This is Shakira's song in there somewhere. <laughs> but whatever. Yeah, the Leon's just uh, dropping clones. Attack of the clones up here. Is this gonna be enough? No. Oh my gosh. 
Oh, that's not good. Where did, where was the frog? Why was the frog around in there is a good question. Oh, shit. I'm gonna grab that HP, and we're gonna go right back to farming if at all possible. I'm gonna wait for our cloud to come up. Maybe he's got a totem. No, we're not gonna need to use either of those. I really want that solar, but we're not gonna get it. Wow, and he died. That sucked. Does he have a spoon now? Nope. Yeah, I mean, yeah, he does. Uh, that's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate, actually. Tenga cuidado, hermano. I don't know what that means. I'll be honest with you, that makes no sense to me. I know that hermano means, uh, like, man, or people, or bodies. But uh, our impact on this match so far has been very lackluster, I think. We haven't done a lot. And I think it's not entirely our fault. Like, we just haven't had any good opportunities. And uh, Vinny is all about exploding opportunities. The instant that you see a good opportunity, if you can manage it, it's a, it's a good time. Oh, here comes, a, here comes a fight. Um, I think we sort of helped to break it up, but I don't know what else we can do right now. Yeah, the threat of dash is keeping people away, but it's not, like, enough. It's not enough at all, unfortunately. Okay, taking it easy. The Leon's back. There we go. Maybe do some damage that way. Back off. Do some more bubble damage. Oh, if that dash had hit... Would have been beautiful. Would have been scrum diddly umptious. Unfortunately, now our bottom lane is taking damage. Yeah, Frog can handle it. Frog's okay. He should, like, I mean, he should be. If he's not okay, then we got a problem. Oh my gosh, somebody wasn't okay. Nicholas! Nicholas! Why? No oh, man. Frog can't defend against all this. Hopefully that blind helps him get away. Sorry, helps us get away. <laughs> oh, this is lame. Hopefully we can uh, pull this together, though. We have a lot of money. Like, give us enough time, we'll be able to pull off anything, really. All right, backing off. I got a ton of money. I need to spend it. Man. What do we do here? Uh, we picked up the wrong upgrade. I meant to pick up the Withered President's Mask last time. That's fine. I'm going to pick up both ranks in this and just call it a day for now. That way we got max damage dashes for the rest of the game. Uh, as long as we, you know, pay our goldfish tax, which we do need to buy up. Again, we're down another 27 cents or something like that. Cents. Wow, I played a lot of Binding of Isaac. When? But yeah, uh, if we manage to actually get that, you know, goldfish tax up and running, we are going to be doing a lot of damage. And at that point, we can start thinking of the utility upgrade that we want to bring with us in uh, future engagements. Managed to deal some damage. I mean, it's not enough. We uh, know that much. But, like, what else do we do here? Ugh, lame. I mean, I hate how Leon can do that sometimes. It's, it, it can be really annoying because he just pokes a lot and then eventually gets a, gets a way in. We knew that we were going to lose the first two towers, but we thought it was going to be because of a Durple more than anything. And I'm dead. Oh, I'm alive? What is this? No, I'm, I'm dead. <laughs> thanks for uh, thanks for landing that dash, Frog. That was super helpful. Wow. Okay. So things that we can work on. Uh, frog is relying on a reduced cooldown on dash, which is not ideal. Uh, Nicholas has a reasonable uh, upgrade path. We are 0-2, though. We should not be complaining too loudly. We have not gotten a single kill yet. Is that entirely my fault? I don't think so. We're not, like, the, the entire team as a whole isn't doing enough damage. It's not like I can be the only source of it. If, uh, if I'm ever the only source of damage, there's a problem going on. Vinny does best when there's a whole lot of other bursts going on behind him. So that way he can kind of, like, just blitz somebody. Like, look at the damage I just put out there. That, that's, that's reasonable, right? Oh, how did that not work? Please tell me we can kill him. How is he not dead? Uh, we got greedy. We're probably gonna die for that. Oh, we lived. Good use of dash. Okay. 
Get back into the fight. The fact that he did not die is de de depressing and is rests on our shoulders. We did not land our dash. So that's on us. Uh, yeah, a lot of bullshit happened in here. And that was a clone, so that didn't do anything helpful for us. Yeah, well, I'm doing 704 damage to dash. What about you, Frog? Oh, what? Only like 300 and something. That kind of makes a problem. So, I think he's going for like double clock slowdown. Which is like, um, okay, I guess. Uh, if you manage to use it with the slowdown first, it's usually a lot better. So, I would recommend that if you decide to go for double clocks on Frog, you actually, you know, get uh, the, the clocks thing. You know, the thing that allows you to do more damage first. That would have been helpful. Yeah, this Leon's got our number. This is not good. Uh, ever since, like, just bad stuff has been happening, it's not stopped. <laughs> uh, we don't have really a lot of money to spend right now. I'm trying to think of what we could pick up. Um, explosion size would be pretty solid. Let's do that. We only have to pick up another 25 solar, and then we'll be back into goldfish tax territory, so it's not so bad. Only, like, another 8 now. Or was it 15? It was 15 to start with, wasn't it? Yeah, I'm not very smart. That's okay. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh my, oh dearie me. You know, I normally considered Vinny to be one of my mains way back in the day. Mur, her, her. But, uh, you know, the times they are changing. Okay. Frog, if you're going to get dash, get the free, like that kind of dash. Please tell me that he's going to get cooldown and then the clocks. Because if he doesn't get the clocks, it's kind of useless. Alright, so we managed to get a kill there. That was on us. That was all good. Uh, it wasn't hard to do either. Now the hard part is that this Leon is going clone army. If they get any push at all, it's kind of going to be game over really, really fast. Oh, come on. We can take care of this really quickly. We just need, uh, we just need to push this out. Come on. Let's go. Let's get this... Uh... There we go. Got a, got a turret. Picking up some coins, getting some HP back for it. Oh, shit. Ah, she's so low. It'd be like a super easy opportunity to go in and dash, but we aren't going to find it quite yet. We need to get another good gank on, the, on these guys is the issue. Ah, I didn't time that right. Okay. Yeah, now we're up against the Swiggins and another thing, and we are going to be the low HP party here. Okay, good, we got them off. Frog. Oh, buddy, frog. Ow. Super tall uh, time rift. Painful, man. Oh, that kill was also painful. There we go. Two for two. That's okay. Alright, good job, frog. Just don't uh, get picked off by a Leon, please. Thanks. There we go. Okay. Speaking of Leon, he's upstairs. We're going to let our droids do some pushing there, because he can. Take those guys out. The exploding does not work on the clones. That is something I figured out a couple of days ago. It kind of sucked, no lie. <laughs> it only works on enemy awesome knots. It doesn't work on the droid waves, which makes it a lot worse. Um, and especially because it still costs about the same amount, if I remember correctly. So, uh, yeah, that that uh, that's the one reason why clone army isn't my favorite anymore. It used to be like easily my favorite, without a doubt. And now it's just like, yeah, it does nothing. So what's the point? Guys, we really do have to defend. I don't know why. Uh, I don't know why we're not defending against all these. Like, there's clones everywhere. Steal him another 738. He's not gonna care though, because in about 20 seconds, he's gonna get it all back. All right, what do we have to do now? We have to get more damage, I think, so that we can push out. Uh, we're gonna pick up the Silence Cloud first and foremost, and then we'll pick up an attack speed upgrade. Actually, the attack speed upgrade is a lot, a uh, lot more solar than I remember it being. Holy shit! So now we're down a bunch of damage for no good reason. And we now have an empty uh, base versus a Leon. This is fan-fucking-tastic. Ah, maybe. There we go. Got one. There we go. Managed to kill off the Leon as well at the cost of our Scree, which kind of sucks. But that's, uh... Not the best, but that's okay. We'll deal with it. Uh, kill off that guy. Use the cloud to help secure that particular thing. And then what? Like, we're doing okay. 
We're doing fine. But, um, past that, I don't know what to tell anybody right now. Yeah, it took her out. That's very nice. That's actually quite nice. Doing some damage. Gonna run away from the swaggins. Bye. <laughs> oh, we lived. That's always nice. Got lots of money again, so that's really good. We managed to pick up another kill, which really helps. Like, now we are doing what we were supposed to be doing, but the problem is that we have an open base versus a Leon. If the Leon knows what he's doing, this is going to be a really shitty fucking game for us in a minute. Yeah, there it is. Like, uh, we've lost this game. There's no doubt in my mind about that. No doubt in my mind as to whether or not we've lost this game. And the reason for that is because they got a Leon who can invisible, who's got a decent push build, and uh, he's got easy access to our base now. So, like, I don't know what else to tell you, but that's that's pretty much the recipe for a game over, usually. And on top of that, our frog went, like, hot bongos nuts. Uh, our screen's had a hard time as well. Like, it, this has not been a good series of games for me. I've been on a bit of a losing streak. On top of the fact that I've been under the weather. And on top of this, on top of that, it's a it's little wonder that I'm feeling a little bit raw these days. <laughs> ah! If anybody's seen the last Nibs uh, game I played, it was utter shit. I mean, I played the crap, anyway. And there goes our Scree. Oh, no, he lives. That's nice. That's good. Wonderful. Yay. The problem is we're down to our base. We have no real push. Our frog has no real damage. Well, he's got some, but he doesn't have the ability to guarantee it anymore. Like. Yep, there's that. Like, if we're lucky. Very, very lucky. We might be able to pull off a win here. If they all come at our base from the right angle, group up together, and play like a bunch of idiots, and take like a million damage for no reason at all. Hey, I want to help, but I, I just, uh, I don't know where to start. Run, Scree. This is our chance to run. Yep, that hurts. That hurts a lot. Okay. We have a lot of HP, though. We're okay on that front. I don't think we're going to die again this game. But at the same time, it's like we're going to lose. <laughs> I, th this is one of those games where you can't really come back. Leon's one of those characters where it's like, oh, if you got a good situation, then you're you're fantastic. You can't really lose. You have a good time. You know, every, everybody is hunky-dory. But, like, look at these guys. They're all full HP. They probably picked up a couple of solar bosses here and there. That would explain a lot. Um, in terms of, like, mystery experience. Like, look at that. You know, these, these kills and these attacks and these defenses and everything would be a lot easier... If we just had, uh, like, slightly more going on for us right now. That's game over. Ah, uh, well. GG, well played. I'm not happy with how our team did. Um, let's see. The screen went for items that made sense. Lots and lots of items that made sense, but just got picked off a lot. That'll happen against the Swiggins. Um, I'm disappointed with our frog, mostly. And my own play early game. My own play early game did not work out very well. And I picked up the wrong upgrade to start off with. Rocketeer's nice, but it didn't really do all that much in the end. Um, it's going double clocks and then not going ice cubes. That kind of, you know, miffed me. Uh, doing, going double clocks is effectively 400 solar that you could have spent on, like... Well, okay, more like 240 solar, sorry. Uh, that you could have spent on damage. I mean, it's good if you never want to die. He then died five times. But, like, it's good if you don't want to die. And the problem is, it's 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 not damage. And so he went into Boombox, but it's like you can't guarantee unless you go Turbo Tape. And even then, it's not guaranteed because they're not slow enough. They're all really light. They have means to, with which to counter you. He went full on into Grapple. Like, if he's got Grapple, he's got Tongue, and she's got Rift, well, what's the point of NATO? So, I don't know. That, that seemed like misplaced priorities to me. And, uh, yeah, we lost. So... That's the game. Thanks everybody so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it yourselves. And I'll see you guys in the next video.